Hi, my name is Janice Lukes and I'm the City Councilor for Waverly West. I am sitting outside um, at my desk of my outdoor office. It's a beautiful day and I've decided to put a short video together to uh, talk to you about staying home and to talk to you about mental health and being outside. We're receiving an incredible amount of information daily, hourly. It can become overwhelming. Um, I want to share with you uh, what I've been doing for my mental health. I've been staying inside. We have three 17 year old teenage boys. My husband's been working from home. Uh, it's quite, uh, quite challenging. And by the sounds of it, kids aren't going to be going back to school and people are going to be staying at home with their children for a long time into the future. So <laughs> I think we really need to focus on our mental health. Um, myself, I need, I need to be outside. I know that sounds like a mixed message saying stay at home and at the same time saying I need to be outside. But for my mental health, I need to walk. I need to be outside. I find it uh, very calming and relaxing. How do you go outside and be safe in the middle of a global pandemic? Well, you have to keep your distance. You have to keep your physical distance. The city of Winnipeg has closed all playground structures. The school divisions have closed all playground structures. But the city is leaving parks open. So we have the opportunity to go to some of our beautiful parks. In Waverly West, we have many large parks. We have countless kilometers of pathways that we can walk on. And we have a lot of residential roads that we can spread out and keep our physical distance. What is the physical distance that we need when we're outside? This is what it looks like. It's six feet on either side or two meters. That's a lot of space. So some of these pathways may be getting crowded. Uh, some of these parks, for sure some of the parks are crowded. I would suggest um, if you find the parks crowded, if you find the pathways crowded, by all means, start walking on the residential streets. Uh, there's a lot of space. You can physical distance yourself wonderfully. There's a lot of space. You can um, apply that uh, physical distance that's needed and, and you can walk, <laughs> walk and walk and walk. Um, walking has the ability to reduce stress. Study after study has shown that uh, stress can be released up to 30% by walking. I, I highly encourage you to uh, get outside, take care of your mental health, be safe. In closing, I would like to thank all our first responders for all the work you do. We so greatly appreciate it. And I want to thank all the students from the universities and colleges that are helping on the front lines. This is an incredible experience that you're going through and uh, we really, really appreciate the work you're doing. Just to remind everyone, my office hours are Monday to Friday, 8.30 to 5. My assistant, Aryan and I are working from home and will answer any question you may have. Take care, be safe, stay in touch.